Hey, what's up my beautiful people? So let's talk about this golden Pikachu over here. Now, you know, you probably have several questions about it. You know, why is it golden? Where did I get it? Why did I get it? And what's the story behind it? Well, before we get into it, let's talk about Tokyo and the popular district of Tokyo, Shibuya. Now Shibuya is pretty much that district in Tokyo where you see like all these people crossing the street and it's just like a big herd of people. You see it in movies all the time. Now in that district, there is a statue of a dog called Hachiko. Now, if you don't know the story behind Hachiko and the statue you know I suggest you look it up you know it's a really famous statue people go up to the statue of the dog Hachiko and they pet it the reason they pet it is for good luck all right now Osaka which is a different city in Osaka there's also a statue and you know in Osaka the statue is called Billiken now the Billiken statue is pretty much like a, a like a doll statue of like this one guy he's known as the god of good fortune so pretty much you go up to the Billiken statue and you rub his feet and you know after you rub his feet it's supposed to bring you good luck and good fortune so in Tokyo in Shibuya the good luck statue is Hachiko the dog statue and in Osaka the statue is Billiken which is like a doll statue you know you rub his feet and it's good luck and good fortune now you can find the Billiken statue in Osaka in the Shinsekai district and the Shinsekai pretty much what that means is new world and I've been there pretty sweet spot to go visit probably one of the best spots in Osaka to visit so you know if you go to Osaka I suggest you check it out. Now anyway, what does this have to do with Pikachu? Well, like I said, Osaka is known for the Billiken statue. And recently in 2019, Osaka opened up its Pokemon Center, the Pokemon Center DX. And right next to the Pokemon Center that they recently opened in 2019, they also opened up a Pokemon Cafe. So all of this was opened in 2019, which is, you know, still pretty recent. Now for their grand opening, when they opened, they decided that, that they're gonna combine Pokemon and their popular statue you Billiken together to create this unique product which is the Billiken Pikachu this is what that is the Billiken Pikachu and the reason it's golden is like good luck good fortune it's like combining Pikachu with the god of good fortune you get this doll so you have Pikachu sitting down so you can rub his feet for good luck so if you buy this it's supposed to bring you good luck and if you gift it to somebody or you receive it as a gift it's supposed to bring more good luck so pretty much that's what this is is the Billiken Pikachu which is combining the Billiken statue with the recently opened Pokemon Center in Osaka. Um, you know, it's just a sweet little thing they did, kind of like their own little unique twist on the Pokemon Center. And you know, besides this doll, they also had like these other mini products. Um, this is just a regular sized Pikachu Billiken doll. They also had like these mini Pikachu Billiken dolls um, with like a keychain. They were a little bit smaller. They had card sleeves of the Billiken Pikachu. And the most expensive item they had was a statue of the Billiken Pikachu, but it wasn't like a plush doll, it was like an actual statue made of 24 karat gold and it was like in this fancy case and when I saw it I really wanted it because it looks so cool but I don't remember the exact price but it was either like two thousand I want to say like two thousand dollars or like ten thousand dollars it was pretty expensive but the reason for that is is because it was made of 24 karat gold um I was willing to spend like you know 500 on it but no no dude this statue was really expensive so I'm guessing it was like real solid gold I don't remember the price man i tried looking on ebay um no one has it no one is selling it because it's a really expensive item like when i saw it i was like dude there's no way i had that kind of money like it was really expensive but it looked really cool so i think it was solid gold and i think it was going for like ten thousand. so it was, it was pretty expensive man that's all i remember about it and i tried looking online i can't find anything about that statue like i found pictures of the statue but i didn't find like the price but if i do find the price of that statue the real price you know i'll drop it here somewhere so that's pretty much what this is the golden pikachu the billet and golden pikachu it's just a osaka product you can only buy this in osaka so you know if you visit japan next time you know try visiting osaka and try picking one of these up um on ebay you know they're selling for pretty expensive i think like this one's probably like 100 bucks on ebay i bought this for like uh, I don't really remember. I think I think this one was like 40 bucks, 30 or 40 bucks. And on eBay, it's selling for double the price. So if you do want one, you, do, you could probably pick one up on eBay or go to Japan, go visit Osaka, go, go visit their Pokemon Center and their Pokemon Cafe and pick one up if they still have it. Because I think, I'm not completely sure, but I think that they only, only sold these during their grand opening, only in Osaka. Not sure. Uh, 
And maybe next time I go to Japan, I'll check. But yeah, that's where I got this, man. Um, it's really cute. And you know, that's how uh, like the whole thing looks like. Hopefully, you know, you guys got some information out of this. You know, I kind of gave you an idea of like why it was golden, where did it originate from, and like the history behind it. Um, but I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, let me know what you think of it. Like, what do you think of the, the little plush right here, this little golden plush? Like, do you guys want one? You know, drop a comment and let me know. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll give this one away. I don't know. <laughs> No, I really like it, man. I really, I really do like it. But anyway, um, let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you think about the plush, and let me know if you enjoyed the video. And of course, if you want to see more videos like this, um, let me know because you know I enjoy talking about Pokemon and I enjoy talking about Japan. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Right? Peace out.